Hello. I hope none of you are very arachnophobic because today we're playing the case of the golden idol, the spider of long- you know what, now thinking about it, the spider is probably more of a metaphorical spider rather than an actual spider, right? That seems more like a title or a person rather than a literal- mm. I didn't really do much research into this, I kinda just bought the DLCs because I really like the main game. Anyhow. Oh, and we already get a cutscene. Okay, it's like a forearm. Ooh. This must be the place. Play pa Pajak. Play Pajak. Okay, so we have like a. I suppose a port civilization with a lot of like a European ship. Uh, a more Eastern ship. I don't know what. And I suppose just rafts. A man with a fez. Oh, wait a minute. Is this... Um, what's his name? Oh, I think we may have seen this guy. Except, like, him older, right? One second. <laughs> I know I just said we're about to play a new game. But, I um, you know. Is that you? Are you wearing the same fez? You, you have a fez, too, but I don't think... No, yours is a moon. Okay, you might be related. Moon and, like, whatever that was. Uh, main menu. <laughs> right. Can I skip? I don't think I can click through this. <laughs> no. Not a moon. I wonder if those are related, or if that, like, the Fez is just a regional thing. Okay. Golden Idol Mysteries, the Spider of Lanka. The overly enthusiastic card game tournament in the Yellow Lily. Hmm. Is that supposed to be like Sri Lanka or just Lanka? Okay, there's a lot of fucking dead people. Holy shit. Um. Wow. Okay, it's you. Oh, you're like moving and talking. That looks a bit weird. I mean, I like it, but that's weird. Oh, you're like, your ear is cut. What in the blazes? They are all dead. Thank you for saving my life, kind sir. A yellow rosette. My dear Zubiri, upon my arrival in just a few days, we'll depart Jampur, jump up, wait, Jampupur together. While you await me, I beg you continue to apply yourself to your studies. As Lemurians, we may be held in high regard in Lanka, but we must not become careless and besmirch the Kara family name. Father, so you're Kara, wait, no, you're Zubiri, Zubiri Kara. And. Are you skilled at Pajak? Test yourself and win money in this grand tournament. June 2nd, at sundown, at the port in the Yellow Lily. Also, the font is completely different. That's like more handwritten. I wonder if that means anything. Le this is so cool, like they have... Okay, so they put a lot more, like, care into the animations this time. Let us leave this unsavory watering hole. You do not appear to have sustained any serious injury, but perhaps a stiff drink will help you settle your nerves. You have a stiletto, a surgical kit. Are you, are you Oberon Geller? One second. An empty pistol, a loaded pistol, a blue rosette. Ah, he's, I'm, I'm so smart. <laughs> I was wondering, you looked like Oberon Geller. Surgeon and hypnotherapist, Island of Lanka. Okay, hmm. I guess John Turner was also kind of a doctor, right? Broke something, pay for it. Yellow Lily card house rules. Too drunk to play, get out. Lost all your money, game over. Someone cheated, sword it yourself. The management accepts no liability if you decide to play against Bill. Who's Bill? Are you Bill? Carter Master, this time I will beat you in Pajak. Get your crew and we shall play in the 8th player tournament at the Yellow Lily. You have like a bloody knife on you. you may, oh, you probably stabbed someone actually. A half empty flask of rum. A necklace made of human ears. Okay, you're probably Bill. Right? A blig and slightly bloody knife. A blue rosette. And a loaded pistol. Oh, and you also have a spear in you. This man is not breathing. A long rapier is stabbed in his back. Okay. Or you, Bill. You have a chakram in your head. Right? Like the th throwing ring thing? A blue rosette. I think that probably... And that's a parry knife, right? No, a 
A point guard knife? What the hell is a point guard knife? <laughs> a dagger. Okay. This clue has been added to the thinking panel. Okay, it looks like this is a roguelike <laughs> deck builder. Oh, it looks like Magic the Gathering, except medieval. Uh, BB. Also, lyrics. Okay, so they have like a blue rosette and a yellow rosette here. Are those planted in a vase? And then they have like an inkwell? Spilling? I don't understand. Okay. Is this the only screen here? That is a giant face. Oh my god, that... That's huge. And I guess this is a different rack. Okay, this is like Magic the Gathering, except medieval. That's cool. Uh, this man is not breathing. Oberon wants to embarrass himself again. Round up Sri and Reuben from the ship and meet at the Yellow Lily around 10. You um, got murdered in the first chapter, right? A clean dagger, an almost empty flask of rum, a yellow rosette, a clean Navaha knife. Hmm. And you have Chakram flowing, throwing blades, a guitar blade, this man's not breathing, and a sword, which actually appears to be, uh, got a tamal? A tamir? A Ch no, it's a Tamir. A Tamal. Oh god, it, it, oh, my sword knowledge. <laughs> oh god, a blue rosette. Um, something T sword, right? Like the, um, the for like an ancient Indian sword. When was it? 16th century? Bronze? I can't remember. And another game, except I don't know what I'm looking at here. What's like with the inkwell? And another game. How do I determine who's won a game? Um, Bajak Tournament card. Carlos Luno, Oberon Geller, Sri Taeson, uh, Pandula Senevi. Oh my god, I'm gonna butcher so many Ray names. Ruben Hendrix. Oh, and wow, they have like Elo. That's funny. Gabriel Hubert. Bill Price. Oh, no, Bill Price, he isn't like super good. He's just like absolutely cracked at the game, right? He's not like a murderer or anything. You're probably not Bill then. Huh. Okay, so... You're, let me mark down who I know. <laughs> um, you're Oberon Geller and you are... something... Kara. What, what was your first name? Zubiri. Zubira Kara. Okay, I'm gonna have to... Zubiri Kara. We're missing people. Is there like an alternate screen I can go to? No, I just haven't clicked on you. A huge and bloody mace which appears to be like... <laughs> the old Buddhist like weird round ball mace things. The man is not breathing and has a harpoon sticking out of him. Who the fuck brought a harpoon? A yellow rosette. My strong friend. Join me tonight for the Bajak tournament at the Yellow Lily. Bill will be present so long as he wins. However, he does not become crazed. So long as he wins, he does not become crazed, right? Please bring Gabriel as a precautionary measure, should Bill lose his temper. Oberon. Okay, so... Oh, you're asleep. The man is asleep and appears to be comfortably drunk. June 8th, 1741. It is cru- and that's the seal of, I believe, the Seven Seas Trading Company, right? It is crucial to our operations in the South Seas to secure trading fortresses in the Lanka Archipelago. A Sri Lankan Archipelago? I don't know much about Sri Lanka. Regrettably, Lemuria continues to object to it and advises the local rulers against their presence. The Lemurians cannot project their power directly, but they still have the spiritual authority in the Lankan kingdoms, which used to belong to the now crumbled Lemurian Empire. The Lemurian influence on Lanka must be broken. Cooperate with her agents in the region, in particular, mage, widower, and doctor could provide useful. Oh, you're an agent of the Seven Seas Company then. Yeah. Remember that your reward for a job well done will be awareness. enormous. Who are you? A stiletto and a clean blade and a falchion? A yellow or a zet? And when drawing lots for match pairings, arrange it so the new newcomer plays against the new, the best player here. He wants to test his skills. And an almost empty flask of rung. Okay, we are not starting off easy. 
They just kind of throw us into the... I, I guess that makes sense. There's only three puzzles, right? Three cases? Let me organize this. Oh, okay. How do I figure this out? Okay, well, we know you probably killed... The Chakram guy probably killed this guy, right? Are they throwing... Are Chakrams used for throwing? I don't know if that's true or not. A person who uses a rapier... I mean, you're probably the guy with the rapier, right? Because you don't have a weapon present on you? So you probably stabbed him. Or maybe you stabbed him. And you have a parrying knife. Or maybe that was your rapier, and then you, you're like left-handed, and you're using the parrying knife as an offhand. Oh my god. And you've bonked someone over the head. Who did you bonk over the head? I'm guessing this guy. You got... I think you probably got shot? Maybe you killed him. Are you empty? An empty pistol, a loaded... Okay, you only fired once, so... That's probably who you killed. Who had a harpoon? Is that like, fired from a harpoon gun, or is it literally just a harpoon? Are you a fisher? Yes, you are. You killed this guy. You have like a tattoo of a fish. I thought that was like a uh, anchor for a second. Okay, how do I figure out your names? Zubiri Kara, Bill Price. So they were... they didn't finish their game, but like maybe he pissed off Bill. Okay, Carlos Luna and Oberon Geller. How do we find that table? You have a blue thing. Okay, let's take a look at the cards. I don't know. I don't know what this represents. Oh, yellow and then blue. Maybe that represents sides? One, two, three. A, C. Oh, no, no, no. This is like the scoreboard. Oh, okay. So this is like to keep score. What, what the hell is this? Like an inkwell, though. I don't under I don't. It looks like a tiny wrapped mummy. <laughs> Okay, the music is kind of going really hard. Um, Oberon Geller. Win, win, win. So be blue... How do we... What color were you? You're blue. So blue, blue, yellow. And then that makes sense. Blue... Yeah, okay, so this has to be Oberon's table. And... I guess this is Oberon's hand. And then this is whoever... Carlos Luna. I'm guessing you're probably Carlos Luna, right? Okay, I'm gonna put that down temporarily. Cause you're close to there. Though I don't know if you exactly saw what is up with the giant face in the wall. I can't it's really fucking with my perspective. I can't tell if the nose is at the ground or if the chin is the ground. I think the chin's the ground. Okay, I'm gonna say Carlos Luna. How do we tell which is the best player? If this hasn't been played yet, maybe? We don't know what this one is, like the ink has been spilled. And then this one is maybe mid-game? Or is that supposed to- oh wait. Okay, this is the Oberon Geller deck, and then he's playing Sri Thyssen. Who's three? Join me, my strong friend. Please bring Gabriel as a precautionary measure should Bill lose- I, I'm guessing this is Bill. He has a ring of human ears, and you also have like a little- Oh no, that's an earring. That's an earring from the guy you butchered, right? This time I will beat you on Pajak. Get your crew and we shall play in the eight player tournament, Quartermaster. Who's Quartermaster? Hmm. So he's like your friend. You seem a bit uncaring that he's fucking dead. <laughs> um Half empty flask of rum. Please bring Gabriel as a precautionary measure should Bill lose his temper. Did you help fight? Are you Gabriel? It is crucial to our operations. Okay, mage, widower, and doctor. Huh. When drawing lots for the match pairings, arrange it so the newcomer plays against the best player here. He wants to test his skills. Your ear is cut. Did you lose an ear or are you just woozy? Zubiri Kara. Oh my god, okay. I need to find like a way to start chipping down identities. Um, we can't tell what this is. Oh wait, no, we can see... 
Is this like the final game of this one? So we know a blue wins with this, right? But this one, three, so that is like an order of actions? Okay, so let's say a bee beats a, a boar beats a peasant. Maybe. Two archers beat a centaur and an archer beats a boar? Fuck, how am I supposed to figure this out? <laughs> am I supposed to like figure out the system at play here? Oh, that's fucked. <laughs> That's so fucked. Hmm. You're a blue guy. How do I figure out who's blue? Blue. You're yellow. So you two are facing each other, probably. You're yellow. Who are you playing? You have a blue one. You also have a blue one. So this is either Bill or this is... I think this is Bill. He looks big. He looks intimidating. He looks pissed. Um... He has ears on his fucking neck, right? It's probably Bill. Bill Price. Hmm. That's a bit of a guess, but like, I think it's a pretty good guess, so... Maybe you got mad and then like, spilled the ink. You two are fighting? You're dead somehow? Okay, I need to figure out who died. Okay, you died last, I think, because you shot, and you're still alive. Or maybe it's just, like, in order of who can kill who. It's like rock, paper, scissors of, like, death. So you shot him, he stabbed this guy, this guy bonked this guy, this guy knifed this guy, and then this guy probably stabbed this guy with his rapier, huh? Who the f- <laughs> Who are you? Okay, oh my god. I think you two are playing each other. Okay, so you're probably... Sri Thyssen or Ruben Hendricks, right? Is there like an empty board? Is there like a default board? Or are you Ruben and you've fallen asleep? Oh my god, you might be Ruben. Cause you're asleep. And you're just kind of chilling. No. Yeah, I think you're asleep. Maybe you're waiting for the game between Bill Price and Zubiri to be... Uh, the one. I like how they have ELO. How do how do you calculate ELO? How, is that like a mathematical equation? Sri Thaisen and Pandula Senveri. Ruben Hendricks and Gabriel Hubert. How do we figure that out? Okay, let me take a look at the thinking panel. Maybe this will help. Who killed who chronologically? I don't know. <laughs> um, order put, put up a jack card, starting with the strongest and ending with the weakest card. Huh. <sighs> okay. I think I understand that. So peasant is probably weaker than boar. I'm assuming this is the final game, right? So peasant's probably weaker than boar. Centaur is probably stronger than Archer, so they have to have two of them, and an Archer is stronger than Boar. Um, so it'd be Peasant... Wait. Yeah, Peasants are just piss awful. Okay. <laughs> peasant, Boar, Archer, Centaur. Fuck. Oh. Hmm. Okay, maybe I have to, like, be a bit more careful of that. I also don't, just don't want to guess randomly. Or maybe Peasant is better than Boar. <laughs> I need to figure out everyone who everyone is first, right? How do, how do I do that? <laughs> okay, who's Gabriel? Join me, my strong friend. Do you mean strong as in, like, you're really good at fucking... Oh, God. Who are you? Why can you decide the thing? Quartermaster, this time I will beat you in Pajak. So you're the quartermaster of a ship. Like, you handle day-to-day -day operations, right? Or, like, you handle stuff. I don't... Oh, God, I don't remember my naval positions. <laughs> okay. I'm not exactly certain on this, then. Carlos Luna. I'm assuming that's because Oberon beat Carlos in the same pattern, right? 
Okay, let me take a look at the inkwells for everything else. If you can't tell, I got confused by <laughs> the thing. Okay, so, and then they reset. Why do you have this table still up then, right? Win, win, win. Win, win, win. That's the, that's the only option it can be. So you have to be Carlos, I think. So you beat him. So it can't be Carlos, it has to be Sri Thaisen or Pandula Cerveni. We have to figure out who is Oberon's facing. Are you yellow? You have a yellow, which one are you? Are you blue? Okay, you might have been facing this guy. So you might be facing Sri Thaisen, whoever that is. Right? Because there's no games played yet, so it's empty. Or it could be Ruben Hendrix. Or it could be any other guy in existence. Why are you sleeping? Appears to be completely drunk. Siri, what, what's your level? 620? Is this equivalent to like chess elo? Because you guys are super low, <laughs> if that's the case. <laughs> then again, I guess it was much harder to have like resources to learn back then, right? You can't just become a chess grandmaster by playing by yourself. I suppose in the 1500s or I suppose this is the 1800s. You can't just look up like... <laughs> Evan's Gambit or some shit. Um, it's probably peasant, like, boar's probably the... Look, I'm just gonna go off my base instincts and say, boar looks peasant. It's probably gonna be the animal, this guy, then this guy, and then the fucking centaur, right? <laughs> the problem is, I don't know. Oh, God. You're not Sri or Ruben. You're not Sri or Ruben, and you are also not the Quartermaster. Who's the Quartermaster? But we have your identity, your Carlos. Sri or Ruben? Round up Sri or Ruben from the ship. So we know they're sailors. Sri or Ruben? Do you have anyone that looks like you, or are you like a big sailing thing? Oberon wants to embarrass himself again. Okay, there seems to be, like, factions. You're probably... Please bring Gabriel as a precautionary measure. Should be a loose's temper. Oh! Okay, so you are on the side of... The Quartermaster, right? So you're on Quartermaster's side, so that's why you're shot. So we have to figure out who you killed. You killed this guy. And you're on Oberon's side. You bonk this guy. So you're probably on this guy's side. You killed this guy. So, by that logic, you are probably... This guy's probably Gabriel, right? I think that guy's Gabriel. That That's a pretty hard guess and, like, pretty loose logic, but, like, that makes sense to me, I think. I don't know who this guy is, then. So these two... His friends, he day he died, he doesn't give a shit. Let's leave this unsavory water foam. You said, mm. Who did you get knifed by? No. Yeah, you're playing this guy. This has to be Bill. Because he, like, attacked your ear because he got pissed. I get it. Oh my god. Okay, well, that's actually obvious in hindsight now. But we also have that. Um, Who's your strong friend? Okay, you're blue and then you're yellow. So you have to be... My strong friend, please bring Gabriel. Bill will be present. So long as he wins, however, he does not become Kraze. Okay. Sri and Ruben, so you're probably Sri and... Sri and then Ruben? Right? I mean, you're probably Ruben just by... Well, your appearance. <laughs> your name is literally Sri. But I don't want to go off stereotypes, because that's lazy. Who's... So, Sri is playing Pandula. And we haven't heard Pandula, so this guy's probably Pandula, right? Ruben, Gabriel, Hubert. Win, win, win. And then he moved on. So you're probably Ruben, because you're alone, and you're at a table with no one. And, like, you're asleep, waiting for him to wait. Finish? Okay, so if you were Ruben... Which table is yours? Gabriel's? This one then, right? Okay, I think I understand. Okay, let me take a look at this. So, if this is... 
Ruben's table. That means he faced... He won. He lost the last one, and you are... Why did they even play, play the last one if they lost? <laughs> I guess for Elo. Okay, you're yellow, and... This side is yellow. Okay. You lost this one. Peasant kills a boar. So maybe it's like best two out of three. You have this one. You have this one. You probably lost this one. Peasant kills an archer? Wait, what color are you? Yellow. No, you lost this one. How did you lose? Okay, peasant kills boar? Centaur and boar... It's like, it has to be best two out of three. Like, whoever has the most lanes, right? Or maybe it's like how much each side is worth. So this is only worth one, this is only worth two. So you have six health, and then... Oh god. Does a peasant kill the archer? That seems like weird. Um... Hmm. This is a weird game. I, I don't understand. Um... Oh, I'm stupid. It's literally only on the side. It's not rounds. It's literally just what side won. Okay, so one. Blue one. The boar is stronger than the peasant, right? Boar is stronger than the peasant. A two. I can't believe I got this mistake in so hard. Two. You win. You are stronger than two archers. Right? And then, blue wins. So, archer is stronger. Yeah. Centaur, and then... Wait, isn't that what I said? I don't understand. Two... Ar centaur one, so it means it's stronger than, like, two archers. And then... Three, blue one. Because the archer is stronger than the boar. Archer is stronger than the boar. Peasant is stronger than the boar. Oh, wait, no, boar is stronger. Okay, peasant and boar are switched. I understand. Never mind. You win? Yeah, blue wins, so peasant has to be weaker than boar. Wait. Am I getting them mixed up? Yeah, peasant has to be weaker than boar here. Because he lost this one, I think, for certain. So the boar is stronger than the peasant. The boar is stronger than the peasant. And number two, the centaur beats, I guess this means win, right? I hope. The centaur mean beats two archers. The centaur beats two archers, and then the archer beats the... Why isn't this incorrect? Starting with the... Look, we don't- we don't talk about that. I- I- I can read, I can read! <laughs> Come on. Oh, that's- that's stupid. Oh, okay. So, here, how do we know their collective strength? Did I have, like, a numerical value? I'm guessing this is, like, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wait. No, Centaur is just fucking jack, so this is worth- Centaur beats two archers, which seems nuts. So, this would be... In fact, I might, like, get down some notes to write this, but probably not. Let's see. Boar, so yellow W. Yellow W. And then... Yellow W. Th this is literally just a sweep. Oh, this is probably Bill's table of, uh... Okay, this is probably Bill's table, then. Bill's table with, uh... What's your name? <laughs> Zabir, I've been thinking about boars too long. Okay, this is a sweep. You got upset. And then this one is... Let's find out what this one is. You're completely unmarked, so we don't know. So you got mad, and then you spilled the ink. Okay, wait, wait, why didn't you guys write down your results? Or are you guys just lazy? Okay. Maybe this is like before it reset. Do we have to figure out this? Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I'm wasting my time with that. I think I might be wasting my time with that. Okay, I think you're Ruben. I don't remember why, but I just think you are. You're Sri and you're probably Pandula, right? 
Oh, wait, no. Oh, we can probably figure out who's who. Okay, you two are playing at a table. Let's find out. WWW. I think you're Sri and you're Pandula, so... Sri is the winner here. Okay, who's the winner at this table? Uh, fuck it. This one's just a sweep. One W. Two. Wait. Yellow. Okay, so <laughs> first one. How do I decide? Okay, yellow W. Blue W. Blue W. So it's like, it's this one. Cause, okay, I got it. So you have to be whoever is the winner, right? This guy. So that would be blue. Do you have blue? No. You are Sri. Okay. I think. Oh, that was hard. Sri and then you have to be Pandula. That, that was painfully hard for me. San Sanavi. And then what was your name? Th Thaisen, Thaisen. Oh, uh... Okay... And then... Let's find out who is the last one. Your bill... I don't think this table matters. And then I guess this is Ruben's table, so he had to reset it? Or maybe this is like the results of the last game. You're probably Gabriel. Who were you playing last? So, it's Oberon versus Sri then. So you get two were supposed to face each other, I think. Okay, well, let's test everyone's identity. Uh, I don't know exact- uh, I don't want to know, know if I want to put in Ruben just yet, because that feels a bit wrong. Because you were probably pl oh, you're probably playing him then. Right? Okay, well, let's find that out. Okay, so it would be Ruben versus Gabriel. And then I'm gonna guess the guy... Oh, well, we don't need to know who is, needs to be alive for this. Okay. Win. 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 Last one has, is on the opposite side. Win, win, win. Ruben's the overall winner. Who's, who's the overall winner here? Yellow. Are you the... O yeah. Okay. That's Ruben. We know that for certain. <laughs> Ruben Hendricks and then Gabriel Hubert. Ruben Hendricks, Gabriel Hubert. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Who killed whom chronologically? I don't know exactly chronologically, but we can infer, right? So it would have to be Oberon killed this guy last, I think. Carlos Luna, you shot him. Right? With a pistol. Carlos Luna, you speared this guy. Pandula Senevri. Pandula Senevri. You clubbed... Oh, actually, I don't know if it's a club. But Jack? Navaha. No. Maced. Sri. Sri. Used a chakra. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> to... Stab Gabriel Hubert. And then Gabriel Hubert... Like, defended... Zubiri from fucking Bill by stabbing him with a rapier. I think. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, blank, 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 uh, blank. Okay, it's a Pajak game to... He tried... Hmm. Bill Price bought Pajak, or not Pajak, uh, Zubiri Carey had cheated. Wait. Bill Price thought Zubiri Kara had cheated. So he tried to take Zubiri Kara's ear, right? That's why he's bleeding from the ear. And then, <laughs> I think Oberon Geller. Okay, wait, I think we're missing a little bit of knowledge. Um, Surgeon and Hypnotist, Island of Lanka. Apply yourself to your studies. You must not bear so much to family name. You just wanted money, right? Test yourself and win money? 
So Zabiri Kara treated, or is it Oberon Geller treated? Wait, what? <laughs> La cheated, lost, paid, treated. Treated a Pajak game to pay a Pajak game? Hmm. I don't know what word fits here. You just wanted to come with this guy, right? And then you wanted to fix this match with this guy, Ruben. Who's the, are you the quartermaster? No. No, you're that guy. Okay, why did you do this? When drawing lots for match pairings, arrange it so the newcomer plays against the best player here. He wants to test his skill. Is that like an innocent thing or is that like actually not innocent? Huh. Okay, it would be Zubiri Kara. Oh, okay, it's a lot. It's a lot simpler than I thought. Ah, the young Lumerian Zubiri Kara, bored of his studies, went to the Yellow Lily to participate in a Pajak tournament. He played against the skilled but hot-headed quartermaster Bill Price and won. Bill, incredulous that he could have lost to a newcomer, accused Zubiri of cheating and tried to take his ear. Oberon's friends then try to defend him, resulting in a chain of deaths. Kind of like World War II. <laughs> oh, that was that's a cool puzzle. On oh, a cool three-headed elephant. Today is the most important day in your life, children. Oh, and a Zubiri. You will meet a Lumerian saint. Are you a saint? Oh, and it's and other powerful people. Oh God, what, what, you're Cloudsley. What, what was your name? How did I forget the original Clouds? It's Sebastian. No, you were before Sebastian. I want to. Okay, one second. Let me. <laughs> we're going all the way back, baby. <laughs> what was your name? Albert Cloudsley. Okay, I was getting you confused in my head with Edmund, but I knew that wasn't right. The unfortunate accident at the Raha's court. Okay, so that's probably the Raha then. Um, okay, we have a giant face, which is actually, like, I think the little title card. I like how they're, like, moving now. I did not expect my first Seven Seas assignment to conclude so shockingly. No wonder these savage countries need to be civilized. That's a bit... Yeah. Tobacco. Not even Ash Blair tobacco at the time. A... Toothpaste gift? I don't... <laughs> Albert, we must strengthen relationships with Abaya the Radiant in order to establish a trading outpost in Lanka and bring these four locally produced pigments to Europe. Usharik, produced in mines filled with toxic gas. Afid, gathered from silverback piranha-infested lakes. Lakwa, harvested from the nesting crickets. Sector, gathered from the sector spider. Oh. Okay, the spider may not have been theoretical. Our cultural tolerance department has provided a gift. A statue appropriate to these devil-worshipping societies. Find out if they appreciate it. Consider pretending to be a devil worshipper too. You have a pipe? Albert, I will not be able to accompany you on your first Seven Seas mission. A pressing matter requires my attention. Ignore whatever rubbish Central Office has suggested. Don't prevent, pretend to be... Like a devil worshipper, Bifen Putra. He has the Raha's ear. When you arrive, place the gift in location as instructed on the wrapping paper. It is meant to be a surprise. Mmm. The mouth. The mouth. <laughs> uh. And then you have a book of names. Seven Seas Company Associate Travel Guide. Oh, not names. Navigation. Navigating by star, North Star. Once you're facing the North Star, you're facing North. Navigating by Crescent Moon. Imagine a line joining the endpoints and down into the horizon. That direction is south. Couldn't you just face away from the North Star? I don't actually know how to navigate by sky. That's kind of cool. Maybe I should learn how to do that. Seven Seas Company Associate Travel Guide. On the island of Lanka, as with many other former colonies of the Lemurian Empire, the Lingula Franca is common Lemurian. This is an example of common Lemurian script. Oh, so when they the different font indicates a different language, I understand. Note that the honorific master is followed by the surname, so Oberon was talking in Lemurian. 
For the last century, the island of Lanka has been divided into the three kingdoms, each named after the ruler's family, Jaffna, Gamini, and the Vihaya kingdoms. Each kingdom is ruled by Raha, who subjugates the peasantry, enabling the cheap production of cloth, pigments, and spices. I'm gonna be so- I'm gonna butcher so many names during this. Uh, what's your deal? And you're speaking in Lemurian. Cease your threats, Lankan Laki. I am not to blame for my father's deceptions, but perhaps this is the price we pay for our stagnating culture. Yours culture? I beg you, cease to request that we meet. You know it is unwise. Venerable Yupik, I- Venerable Yupik's watchful eyes notice everything. He is your father. Yupik is his father, Yupik Kara, and you know his character. He will not tolerate such transgressions. I am a mere servant and must know my place. I can never be part of the Kara family. Ari. Okay, are you trying to mem like marry someone not in, like, royalty? Don't worry, young Lumerian. If it is meant for you to die today, it will be by my hand and swift. I've killed many people for the right and wrong reasons. Such is the Dharma of the warrior. A falchion. My tiger. Have you found anything that might help me earn my rightful title? Then you can be by my side forever. Leave it by the bush by the pier. That insufferable Putra has his dog's death has his dogs search our things regularly, so we must be careful. Your moonlight and soon your queen. Keep your mouth shut, boy. Your father committed a murder and cannot be forgiven. Undoubtedly, his highness will demand your life, a key. Position guards outside the chamber of trials during this test in the morning. Only my children and the priests must be allowed in here. In there. We saw this with the side. Why is this like... A string coming through. Okay. The priest forbids the presence of any Westerners during the ritual, but we do not wish to insult a man of the Seven Seas Company. Entertain Albert Cloudsley Esquire by showing him the gardens during the summer ceremony. Meanwhile, allow nobody to enter the ritual hall except me, my children, and the Lemurian de delegation and a noble Bladesmaster. Probably the Bladesmaster, right? My tiger. There's so much going on. Um... Okay, a sacrificial ceremony. People of Albion, leaf at number A. Oh, you guys are actual devil worshippers. A large statue. Okay, never mind. I'm down with it. The Titiana Printing House. Read and learn the Albion language. The best way to learn this language... Okay, it's Albion. Is to look by looking at the Seven Seas Company gift to the Raha. The best way to learn this language is by looking at the Seven Seas Company gift to the Raha. Despite their name, the Infernal Guard are dedicated to a noble cause, fighting fire. Yelling to clear the way, they hurry to the place of the ordeal to do their unenviable job. The guards do not feel fear, and smirk at things that would be agony to commoners. They bravely step into the Infernal Limbo and do their dirty duty. Challenges they face are like lava and obstacles can be ominous, and during the nights even otherworldly. But inattentiveness is a swift killer. Ignited with bravery, they step into the nightmares. Their burden is monstrous. They often yell commands, already fatigued. If accidents cause such misery, intentional cases are more odious. But the men, unclean and tired, run to the place of terror to face whatever horror awaits them. This you woman has a huge wound across her abdomen, beneath an apron, and she is not breathing. The wooden apron and clothing beneath it have been slashed. There is a mixture of blood. There is a mixture of blood and red paint on the wound. The wooden the wooden apron and the clothing beneath it have been slashed. Huh. A stiff ornamented apron made out of wood. May you travel from darkness to light, from death to immortality. Dear sister, death is a mere illusion that appears to those who cannot grasp absolute reality. November 15th. Tomorrow is the great day. The ritual hall will be opened and Anula will I and Anula and I will be evaluated. Okay, you're being evaluated. So you're Anula. May the light guide my sister in the test for she is worthy of the title. If fate judges me to, if fate judges me to be the one, then I am ready to undergo the journey through the blade to through the blade to the sun and back again to claim my birthright. So what, like a reincarnation? You're probably a Nula, right? Uh, hmm. 
I suggest you do your practice while observing the Seven Seas Company gift to Raha? Is that the same? I think that's slightly different. The Fern Guard. Yeah, this is the same thing. Leaflet number eight. A large statue. Do not did not get precise answers, but this will help. Rotate the line every fourth same. Rotate the line every fourth same color circle. Wait, what? Every fourth same color circle circle square. The number of horizontal lines multiplied by six is easy. Just look carefully. What the fuck is happening? Hey, you have. Oh, you were the gift to the Seven Seas Company. Like, the Seven Seas Company thought they would appreciate literally just a statue of the devil, and they just fucking sent it over. Okay. I wonder if they are hiding out in there. Uh, well, that's kind of fucked. Hello. Okay, you're probably Putro or whoever has the ear, right? You wanted life for life. Oh, most radiant and magnific magnificent Raha. Has this information satisfied your needs? A small box filled with incense sticks. For sharing the secret, I will allow your Zubiri to live. But he must join me on the journey as insurance for your honesty. You are free to leave with your delegation. Various rings with expensive gems, a guitar blade. Okay, so you're, you might not be Putra. A bottle of blue substance labeled Laqua Ink. Magnificent Raha, I accept your invitation to facilitate the test and the initiation. Our delegation will arrive with the necessary equipment at the start of November. Regarding the Westerners, you already know that we strongly advise with trading with them. They do not understand the importance of Lumerian traditions and their ways are impure. High Priest of the Kara Clan. Oh my god. Your magnificence. Some encoded correspondence is being exchanged between someone at the palace and somebody else. I do not like it and my spies are working overtime to discover who's behind this. I still believe it is safe for your children to undergo the test and for the chosen one to go through the rites of rebirth. The Lemurian state confirms that the ritual is the same when you were sworn in when you came of age. By day's end you will have your heir, your highness, master's son. Oh my god, is that everything? Because if not, I'm, I'm fucked. Oh no. Klasapur, Gamini Kingdom, Vihaya Kingdom, Lankapur, Jaffna Kingdom, Jampur. And okay, so this is the three things. We have to figure out where we are. Sector Inc. Dear Putra, I did my best to seduce that Lumerian servant of girl from the Sukhara family so we could obtain successful results for their young prince in the test. Surprisingly, she was not charmed by my advances. I don't know what is wrong with her. Royal Blade Master G seems dubious. Can I trust her? Okay, this is Putra's quarters then. Wear yellow in the evenings. You will be... High air. This was not hard to decode, but the method is curious. P picture is the key. Master, we found this poem in the picture in your palace garbage. Titiana Printing House. Method is dubious. Oh, is it going to be... Two... Six... Two. Two, six, two. Five, four... Ooh, I don't understand this. Maybe that, like note in the bush was referring to that sector spider feed only twice a week oh calmarian scorpion a quick and painful death plain beetle the merciful killer like falling asleep legion centipede after death the victim's body bloats like a balloon in minutes nesting cricket bite stops hard quickly well <laughs> i'm glad to know a beetle well I'm overwhelmed, I'll be honest. Okay, uh... Oh my god, there's even more. <laughs> there's even more. Okay, what the hell is go? Non-Euclidean? No, these are Euclidean shapes. 14. Oh, this is the test. This is like the trial. Okay, whatever happened here. A bottle of teal substance labeled Aphid Ink. Oh. 
Dear Diary, I believe I have found love after all these years. I wonder if I can leave my servitude and marry this brave fighter. The poor boy will be heartbroken, but he should have understood that a long time ago I have no interest in him. My tender petal. I spend my nights restlessly thinking about your sweet lips and eyes. Let's meet again at midnight at the 12th, uh, 12th of November in the Orchard Garden. There we can have privacy to share love in your secrets. Your warrior, Hayan. The woman's not breathing. You have a beetle on you? Oh, did you poison yourself by accident? Are you bloating? What's that? What the hell is happening here? Uh. Okay. The hall will be unlocked in the morning. They take the test. When the winner is revealed, we will lock it again. The evening before the ritual, lock yourself inside and set everything up. Remember to prepare the apron from the one who succeeds. The red paint is in the vase. You peek. I'm so fucking... <laughs> There's more. Let me rotate... Row me in the eye. Okay. No. Okay. Huh. Okay, maybe this is like what the trial is supposed to be. So, someone eats... No, someone gives bread to like... Someone's sick, right? I don't know. They climb on top of the chain. They get ascended? Oh, wait a second. So what, are you supposed to say like the person who wears the brown apron is supposed to take this life? Right? So you ascend to heaven and then you take the body of this guy? Except you died. And the green guy gives you bread. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay, so there's two people taking a test. And then someone just fucking died. Okay, I'm gonna guess pink, a bottle of pink substance labeled, or hick ink. I guess this is the rotating thing, 18. Whatever this is, I don't know what that is. Okay. Oh, there's even more. Okay, no, no, oh, wait. No, there's still more terms I haven't found, apparently. Huh. I just want to find all the terms. <laughs> oh my god, where's everything? Uh. Did I miss anything? Oh my, wait. The following people are allowed in the ritual hall on November 16th. During the testing procedure in the morning, the Lemurian priest, the potential hire, heirs. During the ritual of the Blade in the evening, the Lemurian delegation, the royal family, Spy Master and Blade Master. Okay. You are... I know you're Blade Master something. Oh, never fucking mind. Um... Your name was in here somewhere, right? Hayan. I think. So you're high on. Maybe. Uh, I know what your name is. You're Kara something. Uh, K Kara. Zubiri Kara. I'm uh, Zubiri Kara. You are the Raha. Right? Where the Raha? The Raya? Where is that? <laughs> um, I don't know. Okay, what's up with the sacrifice here? Is that different? May you travel from darkness to light, from death to immortality. Dear sister, death is a mere illusion that appears to those who cannot grasp absolute reality. I suggest you do your language practice while observing the Seven Seas Company gift to Raya. The best way to learn this language is by looking at the Seven Seas Company gift to the Raja. So you were saying... Look at the company gift. Did not get precise answers, but this will help. Rotate the line. Every fourth... Rotate... Are you saying rotate the line? Every fourth, same color. Circle, circle, square. Rotate the line. Hmm. The number of horizontal lines multiplied by six. Number of, number of horizontal lines multiplied by six? Okay, why is there like a weird... What is this supposed to test? It is easy, just look carefully. Oh, and this is supposed to test your like... 
This is incorrect. I can tell you that right away. Wait, is it? I'm like rotating this in my mind. Yeah, that's incorrect, right? It would be... Did you guys both get it wrong? Okay, if that part is sticking... Oh, wait, maybe I'm looking at it from the wrong angle. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> God, okay. A two... No. Mmm. Wait, that could... I'm confused. <laughs> Can I rotate this? This is in Blender. Lumerian delegation consists of Zubiri Kara, something else. Ah, uh, okay. Let's figure out everything. Let's just put in Cloudsley, Albert Cloudsley from the Seven Seas Company. You are probably, you have the ear of someone. Who are you? That insufferable Putra has met his, has his dog search of things regularly. And then you're saying, who has the, befriend Putra. Okay, I think that's probably Putra. Who's Putra? Uh, Putra. Putra. Okay, you're Putra. And then you have Ari. Who's Ari? Venerable Yupik's watchful eyes notice everything. He is your father, so it's Yupik Kara. You could also be Yupik Kara since you're like begging for his life, right? You wanted life for life or most radiant Mairaha. Has this information satisfied your needs? For sharing the sequel, I allow your Zubiri to live, but he must join on the, me on the journey as insurance for your honesty. You're free to- okay, you're probably part of the delegation then, right? Hmm. My brain is overheating. <laughs> okay, so there's two sacrifices here. One person was sacrificed here. You had like a blade. So you failed the test of the blade, I think, right? So you went up on this blade. So you drank a thing. You fell asleep. The test of the blade was supposed to like... Or was it, like, supposed to, like, not reach you somewhat? Oh, and was it- what, what's this? During the test- the, okay. So you pick one person, right? And then you proceed with the thing. So you are the bro- so you are the child of this person, right? So we have to figure out which, like, of the three places this is. Your moonlight and soon your queen. My tiger. Okay, my tiger. So soon your queen and you wanted an heir, so you're supposed to be the queen. So you were courting the blade master or the warrior or whatever. And then whose room is this again? We found this poem and picture at the in the palace garbage, September 5. Picture is the key. How do we picture is the key? This was not hard to decode, but the method is curious. Oh! Da da da. You will be heir. Maybe, okay. Hmm. Royal Blade Master G. Okay, so you are giant Hayan He. I think you're Hayan He in the city of something. The Fahaya Lankper... Okay, uh, some, we have to figure out who... Let's figure out where we are first. I think that's probably the most important. Keep your mouth shut, boy. Your father committed a murder. Undoubtedly, his highness will demand your life. That's not his highness, though. That's his father. You wanted life for life. I allow yours to be... Okay, so he is his father. Um... Abhaya the Radiant. Abhaya is this guy, the Radiant. You are not Putra, you are Kara. I think. Where's Kara? You are Kara, and then we ha you had your father's name in the thing. He is your father. Yupik Kara. Okay, you are Yupik Kara. Abhaya, and then we have to figure out what the last name is of, like, this guy. Hmm. I don't know who you are. 
entertain Albert Cloudsley, position guards. You have a red key. The red key goes into this thing. And then they, that person had like a bug squish in their thing. And that's probably missing one, right? Hmm. Feed only twice a week. Quick and painful death. And then we know one is made from a spider, so... What the fuck is this thing? Like, you got crushed? Blue. Why is there like a weird... Oh. Oh, someone was... Okay, so the test of the blade is like... That thing is supposed to trigger so you don't actually fucking die. Right? But someone was in there so it stopped the mechanism from working so they got cut. Not fully, but halfway because their torso wasn't fully sunk in. So, whoever you are, my tender petal... I spend nights... Okay, who are you? Dear diary, I finally found love after all these years. You peek. The hall will be unlocked in the morning. They take the test. When the winner is revealed, we will lock it again. Lock yourself inside and set everything up. Remember to prepare the apron for the one who succeeds. The red paint is in the vase. Where's the vase? So the red paint is just supposed to be blood, except they actually fucked up. So they died. So they're try- like, I think the Lemurians tried to rig the test in someone's favor. I think. Oh, I missed this. Tomorrow's a big day, my heart trans tra trembles with anticipation. If Tisa passes the test, I will feel like I have failed. I will admit witness his ritual of the blade with joy in my heart. I will not feel like I failed. Okay, you have good- Okay, so he's Tisa, you are something else. Uh, Ari? Who was Ari? No. You were Al Anula. Tisa. And I think you're probably part of the Kara clan, and then... Or maybe you're Putra. Who, who, has, who has the guy's ear? God, okay. Huh. I suggest you... While well, observing the Seven Seas Company gift. So that's why it's visible when you can check this. It's to find the code. How do we... Is it like horns? Like... Horns, eyes, weapon, claws, feet, five, seven, two, <laughs> is it like based off features, three, three, two, three, two, two, oh my god, I don't understand. Mm. Leaflet eight, what was that leaflet? How, how do we figure out eight? <laughs> Okay, let, let me take a look at this one. Fuck, I don't know. Uh, September 5th. So what, do we have to date it using that and then, like, figure it out? So, you have a weapon and it's three. This was not hard to decode, but the method is curious. I, mm, clearly I am lacking intelligence. <laughs> okay, so half the... Uh... Lanka C. I wish I want to find like that information where it told told me about like the delegation or was it I think it was actually this one. Infernal Guard. I don't know. This is People of Albion. I don't know who that Infernal Guard is, but you're probably the Blade Master. You're probably the Spy Master, right? You look like you. Sp mm. So someone like fuff like failed to decode the message. Who's this bedroom then? Whose room is this? Royal Bl Putra. Who's Putra? Are you Putra? I did my best to seduce that Lumurian servant from the Sukra family. Sukra! Wait. Lumurian servant? Sukra. I think that's probably this... Okay, Sukra, right? So you, like, so hidden here. I get it. And then... Dear Putra. So you have to be Putra. I think. You're probably Putra. A surprise- yeah, because you have access to the red thing in here. I understand. Surprisingly, she was not charmed by my advances. I do not know what is wrong with her. Apparently she is? Or maybe that's like a fake thing. I have found love after all these years. I wonder if I can leave my servitude and marry this brave fighter. The poor boy will be heartbroken, but he should have understood that a long time ago. I have no interest in him. And you have a blue thing. Woman is an, You might not be dead then. Because what, 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 didn't the blue one... Which one's the blue one? A cricket. 
Bite stops heart quickly. No. Quick and painful death. Merciful killer. Okay, maybe it's just this one. Oh. Oh, that's difficult. I've like tried to figure out who the delegation you wanted life for life. Oh, radiant, magnificent Raha has this information said. So you're his father, and then what did you, what information did you give him? Probably on the golden idol, right? <laughs> that's that's magnificent Raha, high priest of the Kara. Oh, Raha, what, okay, is there like do we actually have that term in here, or am I just blind? I think I'm blind. <laughs> it's a clickable term, right? Uh, apparently not. Apparently not. Okay. Oh, Raha. Okay, it's a clickable term, but it's just like a title. It's not his actual name. Oh, God. Where was the information? Oh my God, it was in your book. The Hafna Gamini and Vihaya kingdoms. Each kingdom is ruled by Raha, who subjugates the peasantry, enabling the cheap production. Master, okay. Note the honorific master is followed by the surname. Ma okay, what? Honorific master is followed by, okay, Raha, right? The lingua franca is in the common... This is an example of common Lemurians. I don't know what the lingua franca is the common Lemurian. For the last century, the island of Lanka has been in each name by their ruler's family. Hafna, Gamini, and Vahaya. I wonder if we can tell from like the environment. When it like, appears it's like the red area, right? So it'd be Vahaya? But I don't think we can go off that. No, there's like a weird thing here. Like a weird bonsai tree? Oh! I understand we have to use the stars to navigate wait so south is that way I get it and that's why we can see that so south is that way and then one second that direction is south and then now we know where we are because the, the tree is south so therefore we have to be here we are in clu uh, clusapur, clusapur, right would you be putra clusapur no i think that's the case right i beg you cease to request i meet me you know it is unwise okay and i think this is like you were interested in the servant so you like asked to meet so Ar Ari Sukuna you actually like ended up liking the warrior despite he thinking not so you like tried to stay behind or something so by hiding in the thing I don't understand you're probably also Clusiper then I think and then you Putra I don't know it's Putra do we have like your last name dogs hmm okay what the fuck does the the gift is in the mouth. The gift is in the mouth. One, two, three. I don't understand what that means. The gift is in the mouth. Huh. Consider pretending to be a devil worshiper. I will not be able to. He has the Raha's ear. Place the gift in the location as instructed in the wrapping paper. It is meant to be a surprise. What is... This is the wrapping paper, so it's a small object, right? Place the gift as instructed in the wrapping paper. Place the gift as instructed in the wrapping... This is like the only thing that can fit. Row me in the eye. Tomorrow... Meet me in the eye? Fuck. Who's the green guy? I don't understand. Okay, so the green guy is supposed to be maybe the saint, right? And the three watchful... Ooh, I wonder if that's the origin of the Brotherhood's eyes, then. Okay. 
You took like a bread, you fainted. The test of the blade was supposed to kill you and then like wake you up, right? But I, I think the mechanism is just supposed to drop you in here so you don't immediately fucking get sliced in half, right? So, one of these is correct. And I'm guessing whoever, what, which one's the correct one is made, done by Anula, right? And then Tisa's the one that failed. And succeeded and then failed, I guess. Okay, let, let me do this. Let me try to do some basic, like, actual functioning. Uh, what is this one? Number of horizontal lines divided by six. So there's three horizontal lines. So therefore it has to be 18, right? 18. Okay, 18, and you were pro done by Anula Clusiper. Anula? Where are you? Clusiper, and then you succeeded, and then... Where, where's your name? Tisa, you failed. So therefore, you didn't undergo the trial of the blade. Fuck. Um... It's probably the last name, right? Maybe I got the location wrong. That direction is south. It, it's like, it ha we have to be here. Clusiper, Gamini. Oh, we're in the Gamini Kingdom. Clusiper is just the capital. Oh, oh wait, okay. I think I, I think I understand where I messed up. Gamini, Gamini. Okay, I just messed that up. Um, Gamini, 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 whatever. And then Petra, Putra, I don't know who you're part of. Um, you, Abai, Abahagami, where, where is that? Abahagami, and you are in the kingdom of Clusiper. Clusiper, Abaha, and then I'm guessing Putra is a spy master because he has all the poison shit too. We have to figure out his last name. I don't know how to do that. I mean, I could guess, but that's stupid. <laughs> um... Abaha, where, where, where's your Gamini? Oh, Gamini. And then the Lemurian de delegation consists of... Who is it? Kara? There's two Karas. The father, the son. So it'd be Yupik. And... Where is... Zubiri? Zubiri, <laughs> Zubiri. I sorted by Z. Zubiri Kara and then Ari Gai. We can confirm these identities at least, right? Ari Gamini. Ga G. <laughs> Where is G? Wait, Gamini? Why did I say you were Gamini? Oh fuck, did I replace your last name by accident? Or did, like, did I know your last name at one point? Yupik. The red paint is in the vase. Lock yourself inside and set everything up. Prepare the apron for the one who succeeds. So you're supposed to help them, right? But maybe you got poisoned? Is that just to prevent them? So you're, I'm guessing like your whole thing is you have to prevent them from dying, right? Maybe that's your task and like you didn't actually get crushed, but like you got poisoned to death. You have like the blue paint. Are you colorblind, maybe? I found love after all these years. My tender petal. There we can share privacy. Where did we see the 12th of November? We saw the 12th of November somewhere, right? Okay, I thought that might have led somewhere else. Um, October, High Priest. To, uh, to facilitate the test, our delegation will arrive with the necessary equipment. So that was, you're supposed to do the test. Except the person messed up, right? Some encoded correspondence is being exchanged by someone at the palace and by somebody else. I do not like it. My spies are working overtime to discover who's behind this. I still believe it is safe for your children to undergo Spy Master Son. What's your last name? It wouldn't just be... Because you're a servant, right? I, I don't think the servant would have the name of the high family. Ari, care of family. How do we... Is your last name Petal? I don't think it is, right? I think that's just like... 
Tender Petal, Love and Secrets Hyan, Yupik. How do we find out your last name? How do we find out your last name? Um. Huh. Sukra family. Fuck. We're close though. That that. Okay, Putra son. I think that makes sense because he has a me like message from the spy master. Putra son, or maybe it's son Putra, or maybe I have your like names messed up. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. I was wondering if you're like messed up because like they mentioned something about like the honorary tile, but I think that's just supposed to say you're supposed to say Raya first. Tisa, no, you're not Clusiper. You're Gamini. You're Gamini, right? Oh my God, that feels so good. And then Putra Sun is the spy master. Carrie and then Ari Sukra. Okay, I think I understand. I want to figure out the code. Ah, oh God, I want to figure out the code, but I don't know if it's possible. Like, it says it's obvious. This was not hard to decode, but the method is curious. You found it September 5th. Two. Five? In the palace grounds. How do we... Mm. Release your inner line. Fervous sleep is your heart. Oh, God. What if this is going to be something cool? I understand. I probably... Okay, let me try to fill this out, right? Blank, 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 blank. We, which he was using a blank when it was delivered by blank. This resulted in the death of blank. As a result... Uh... Abaya... Gamni... Zandid Zubiri... Kara's life, but instead... Where is it? UP Kara... Exchange revealed a secret in exchange, probably Lemuria, right? So you're probably giving out the information to the location of the idol. That's my bet, right? Because you're part of the Lemurian Empire, and then you had like a map there or something. So, no, Oberon had the map. How did Oberon have the map? Wait a minute. Are you part of the same company? First Seven Seas mission. One second. Were you were you also part of the same company? Because I remember you had a... Wait, what? Didn't you have like a note on you or something weird? I don't understand. You had like something about being... Or is that just you? No, you! Okay, never mind. You were part of the Seven Seas Company. You're definitely not, then. Oh my god. <laughs> my brain. Okay, this resulted in the death of... Anula Gamni. Okay, I have to figure out, like, the base information then. I understand the elements, but I need to put it all together. So, you guys came here on delegation. You came here. You, you're you supposed to give out information, I think, right? What does the mouth... The gift is in the mouth. The gift is in the mouth. A large statue. Do we know when this was released? Leaflet 8. I don't understand is by looking at the Seven Seas Company gift to Daraya. You have like seven, two nipple, I don't know, maybe I'm like extrapolating information? Am I, am I thick? You have like a V on your thing? Five? Oh god. I have a feeling it's something to do like that, but like... And then you have a yellow weapon, but okay. Let me take a look at this, because if we can figure out how to decode this... We found this picture in the palace garbage, September 5th. Picture is key. This was the dog of Sutra. This was not hard to decode. Picture is the key. Why are you saying key like that? 
you two, maybe like 262. Uh, it's not like how you're staring, because that would be too inaccurate, right? Two... I don't understand. <laughs> you have like one little nubbin. Just roar at the sky. Do not trust your servant, trust your instinct. Eat. Hunter. Emperor, beast, leap, lion, impulsive, wilder. Oh my god. It's words that relate to it. Infernal. Fire. Infernal fire. Yelling. Okay, let me actually write this down, because I don't think I'm going to be able to do this. <laughs> oh god. One second. Let me pull out the old notebook on the new page. So be infernal fire. The infernal fire yelling because he's yelling, right? Yelling. Yelling. It's been a while since I wrote on anything. Place ordeal. Hurry. I think that's ordeal, right? Yelling ordeal. Unenviable? It's like things... Wait, one second. Okay, so it's like the first letter of each word. I understand. But like, <laughs> we just have to figure out... Unenviable. Un... -en viable I think. Viable. Because that... Like, uh, to do their job? I don't know. Do not feel fear. I think fear is probably the closest, right? Fear. And then some agony? Fear, agony. Why did I do it this way? <laughs> agony. Infernal. Are you supposed to decode this? I guess limbo. So let's let's decode the first couple of letter lines and see what we have. So be if you fail if you fail lava obstacles can be ominous ominous I I, I probably don't need to write the like the words I can just write the letters right L O otherworldly if you fail, look killer. So if you fail, look, uh, I, N, nightmares, M for monstrous, um, Y for yell, M for misery, look in my, M for odious? I don't know. M and then unclean. Look in my mouth. T. Look in my mouth. If you fail, look in my mouth. I don't. Okay, so if you fail, look in my mouth. Huh. If you fail, look in my mouth. Okay, so... The Seven Seas Company was trying to interfere with something. Right? Look in my mouth. The present is in the mouth, so you delivered something into the mouth. Or maybe, if you fail, look in my mouth. In the eye. Tomorrow in the eye. Wait, tomorrow. M me in the eye. Look me in the eye? Row me in the eye. Oh, that has to be something. I'm missing something. Okay. Which you found in the mouth of the... statue. By using a secret code he found. So it was probably the poison, right? So Ari Sukuna probably technically killed... Right? Uh... 
Anula Gamini using a... Hmm. So you don't trust them. Wait. Is this a code too? No, are you like actually in love with him? No, you didn't kill him, right? Using a... F like a beetle? A scorpion? Okay, what, what, which one produces blue dye? Um, important. Blue dye produces... Blue dye. Hmm. Toxic. Harvested. Sector. Okay, let's figure out what the sector spiders are. Uh... Wait, 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 we have... Laku... Laqua ink. Laqua ink, right? Laqua ink. Oh. No? What the hell is Laqua ink made by? Nesting crickets. Harvested by the nesting cricket. Bite starts... Okay, so that's poisonous, kind of. So you... Using a poison, so I guess cricket. Hmm. Wait, the spy master killed her. It's the spy master who's you killed. It was delivered by. Oberon Geller. Right? Or Albert Cloudsley. Oh, shit. Hayan He killed Ari Sukuna, Sukura using a cricket, which he found in the mouth of the statue. Right? It was delivered by Albert Cloudsley. This resulted in the death of Anula Gamini. Yeah! Wait, so you... Maybe... Did a Bahia kill her by on purpose? Is he that cruel? So you lock yourself and set everything up. Remember to prepare the apron. Tomorrow, me and the eye. So you actually properly seduced, or maybe it was Sutra, right? Cause Sutra has access to everything. Seems dubious. Can I trust them? I did my best to seduce that lure. No, you're the mastermind. It was delivered by Sutra. That makes so much sense. So Putra's son killed her. Which resulted in... That's weird. Why did you... Huh. Okay, maybe it's a little bit of a coup going on here. It was delivered by uh, the high on he when they met in the orchards. No, not even close. Okay, never mind. Oh my god, my brain is like dying. <laughs> um, your moonlight and soon your queen. Have you found anything that might help me earn my rightful title? Then you can be by my side forever. Leave it in the bush by the pyre. That insufferable Putra has his dog search her things regularly, so he must be... Okay. You. Right? No. Insufferable Putra? My rightful title. Your moonlight and suitor... Okay, I'm guessing you're the moonlight, right? Your personality's just a bit different. You don't write in the same style, oddly enough. Hmm. Okay, I think... You gave... No. One second, I need to think. <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay. Let's work backwards. I want to figure out the events. You died... Or I suppose, uh, 
Anula Gamni died because this person, who was trying to administer the test, died because of a beetle, right? Tomorrow in... Tomorrow me in the eye. Tomorrow me in the eye, I don't understand. So you had like a poisonous beetle on you, that was given to you by, I think, probably... Hayan He, right? Because you had... The... What was in the mouth? So it was in the mouth, right? So who had access to the mouth? If you fail, look at the mouth. So these both, these people both had... I suggest you do your language practice while observing the Seven Seas Company gift, right? If you fail, look me, look me in my mouth. So, oh, so if you fail, look in my mouth. So it, the Seven Seas Company is doing some shit or whoever this, the, the TPH is, right? Look me in my mouth if you fail. So you failed. So therefore, you looked in your mouth and then you found something. What did you find? Fuck me. Oh my god, what did you find? Okay, it was delivered by, like, Albert Clousey, because you put it in the mouth, right? Who killed her? Who ha- okay, okay, let's go back. So, on the day of the test, you guys had this information. But the information was given to you by how to pass the test. It was given to you by Blade Master. Wait, was it? Right? It was given to you. Okay. You had the Blade Master help you pass the test from Putra, because you hit it right here, right? Why did you have this information? So you. Then you can be my- so like, you wanted to marry into the family, to be a queen, to be a king, I suppose, like, uh, King Cohort or something. Cohort. And then... So you did that, but at the same time, you were working for Putra... ...to try to seduce... It's Putra. Or it all comes down to Putra's son, right? Unless... ...you killed him on purpose. Regarding the Westerners, High Priest of the Kara Clan is being exchanged by someone at the palace and I do not like it. I still believe it is safe. Hmm. I think this was the whole thing was organized by Putra's son. Was killed by Did I do this wrong somehow? Abhaya Gamni, the, the van did Zubiri Kara's life, but in exchange, Yupi Kara revealed a secret in exchange. Putra's son killed Arasukara Arasukara using a cricket, which he found in the mouth of the statue. Wait, why? It was delivered by Albert Cloudsley. No, it was... Why do you have the cricket? Open me... Tomorrow in the eye? I don't understand. So you have the cricket in your hand and then you like squashed it? Why did you squash it? Why did you open it? Why did you- you have the cricket on you? You're supposed to do the test, I don't understand. Okay, and the red paint was just to like fool people into thinking... Ah, uh, feed ink... Or shike ink, and I guess 18. Hmm. Okay, that's like where I'm confused. So you open the cri break me tomorrow? Like this got broken by accident or like, no, this got broken. So you had to do it of your own will. Why did you, cr did you eat it? No, you like crushed it on your finger. So like it bit you and then like you squished your hand reflexively. Wow, oh God, I'm confused. I think I understand most things, I just don't understand. Is there like another of these like newspapers I'm missing or something? Regarding the Westerners, we advise... Okay, and then I'm guessing this... 
So why... Tomorrow and I, the gift. That was written in green. What color was this written in? Green, of course. So this is like orchestrated by the company, right? So if you fail, so they wanted him to be heir? Death is a mere... You killed your own sister. May light guide my sister in the test, for she is worthy of the title. You killed your sister. Oh my god. So you intentionally- wait, did you intentionally fail? I don't want to- You intentionally failed, and you deposited the thing in the eye. I understand. Young Prince Tisa failed to pass the Lemurian test to become a hare. So, as advised by a secret correspondent, he took receipt of a bottle containing a deadly insect along with instructions, delivered by Albert Cloudsley. Before the ritual, Tisa threw the bottle in the machine and murdered Lemurian servant Ari. She could not lower Princess Anula and the princess died. I understand. Oh my god, that's so cool. That's so difficult. Okay, what's going on here? The spider of Lanka in the web of the spider. Okay. Man, I can't believe I got so conf I should have been looking at the colors of the ink. And you are... Haha. -ha. You thought you can fool me, spider. I've captured you and you will now answer for the death of the princess. Uh, Hamadar Alara's son and if Oh my god. Ifa... Ifa Vildar Lanha Sinha will hide in the boats and guard the second entrance. Titiana Printing Company. Oh, Titiana Printing House. The ambush of the spider. Front door. Hatch. I will approach the front door with... Elara Sinha and... Kithri Bandar. So, like... Oh. Never mind. Ooh, what? Master Putrasan. These are all five shareholders of the Titiana Printing House. All five of them are affiliated with the Seven Seas Company. Have a good hunt. I hope you'll arrest the bastard. Siva Udawate, Master of Archive and Library. Albert Clownsley, Place of Birth, Blackfield, Albion. Okay, this is probably useful later. Is sent by the Seven Seas Company and head office to establish a new trading post in Lanka. Dangerous and very arrogant. Cannot be bothered to learn the basics of common Lemurian to improve his situation here. Narcissus, Narcissus Mont Montalban. Place of birth unknown, claims to be a thousand years old. Do you have married to alchemy? Oh, you're probably- wait, are you part of the Brotherhood? Natural philosopher, alchemist, and astrologer, banished from the Society of Hermetic Thought for revealing their secrets, claim to be able to swift- switch someone's life off. Ooh, you might have knowledge of the- Several philosophers who had conflicts with him died from unexplained causes. Fairy day. You might have a golden idol. La de Avrox. Chanteau de Avrox Aquitan. We've heard that. At Aquitan Marquias, despite his stature, he is a master swordsman. He has killed at least seven people in duels and was subsequently banished from Aquitia. Wears expensive clothing. Afraid of heights, may attack without provocation. Extremely dangerous. Oberon Geller. Ship. Unmarried has concealed at least. Okay, he's a has a Lankan mistress. A surgeon hypnotherapist. Probably an agent of the Seven Seas Company, has connections to the underworld and is well respected among pirates for providing medical services to their people. Curious about Lonkin and Lemurian culture, a charming charlatan who avoids damaging his own reputation, somewhat dangerous. Robin Hendricks. So these two were in cahoots. Well, I guess we technically knew that, didn't we? Because, like, you told them to organize a thing, right? A shipwright and former carpenter on the pirate Rabid Raccoon has a wooden leg, pretends to be drunk and quiet when the be benefits <laughs> explained, so he wasn't pl blackout drunk, he was just pretending to be asleep. Steals and instigator rides, made a fortune on pi Payak, which makes me wonder if he hides cards in his wooden leg, somewhat dangerous. Ooh. Master Putrasan, I've already shared my suspicions about the disaster of the rebirth ritual. 
He is one of the shareholders of the Titiana Printing House, but my honor does not allow me to reveal his name. However, he goes by the name Spider and I plan to meet him at the Printing House on November 22nd. Let me settle my private matter with him first and then he is all yours. A gunpoint. Me insolence. Blasphemy. The Titiana Printing House, huh? Okay. It is hard to understand the master. The mask is muffling his voice. We have to get it off by properly interrogating him. Club. He does not appear to be armed. We just searched him. Ha! Huh. You thought you the disguise would have saved you? No luck for you, spider. Curve sword with a clean blade. Oh. Tonight during the operation, we will practice an old Lankan code. Imagine what the number... Imagine what number the picture represents. In this sentence, count the word matching that number. The zero... Follow your orders. Trust no one except me. Me. So five? So imagine what the number the picture represents. In this sentence, catch, count the word matching that number. But the picture, I, this represents five, right? Follow me. No. But that's zero, right? That doesn't make sense. Follow, it'd be nothing, right? Because position zero is just me. Trust no one except me, huh? Okay, what's going on? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, we know the water level is 6.5. Where the fuck are we? Okay, let's, let's look around here first. Titiana Printing House. They stole a mask off here. And actually, that mask is locked onto this person, so... Huh. Educational pictures for The Little Putra by Spider. Uh... Okay, so they probably made the card game, and then there's a spider... ...a thing, and they do ma- I'm sw- okay. So the spider is manipulating... ...this guy to put liquid death into the hat of... ...the weird wizard thing, right? So the weird wizard thing... Also, this guy, like, turned really old in, like, the course of this... And then the wizard thing gave a gift to the spider, but the spider stole his wings. I don't understand. Okay, palace guard. Oh, I guess we can figure out who who's who with that. Okay, that's good to know. Um... So it's midday, right? It's like afternoon, 6.5. Uh, red track, so, okay, this is like the dye forms where they like crush dye. I guess this is like where they transport it. 30 ser, basket maximum load, four vases. Okay. A large cloak, that's the cloak of... That's the cloak of the guy, right? Also, there's a fucking scooter, excuse me? <laughs> That's the cloak of the father of Zubiri. What was his name? Okay, we have to- Oh, no. I don't understand. Okay. Let's take a minute. So someone rode the basket and then escaped off. I'm guessing it was the guy pretending to be Zubiri's father or something? One second. One second. One second. One second. I think I understand. Green eyes. Green eyes. Somewhat green eyes. Maybe that's Oberon Geller. That's why they have the map. Huh. Okay. Well, be on the lookout for green eyes, I guess. And that's like, or maybe someone impersonated them during this time? Or is that like... No. Okay, I have to think. Hmm. Lemurians. They have forced my hand with their conservative stubbornness. I will not let these old mystics sabotage the Seven Seas Company's needs. It is time to invest in some creative research and see if I can find more about their secretive rituals and what makes them tick. 
What a peculiar principle, life for life. If you do something good or bad to Lemurian, he is obligated to return the same amount back. Is it really that black and white, or is there some diplomatic leeway? You're talking about the... You're talking about the Golden Idol, right? Huh. So it was used to, like, pay back those who helped you in the past. More and more evidence has, has led me to believe that the Lankan legend about the Fountain of Youth on a secret island and the rumors about the Forbidden Golden Idol refer to the same thing. Lemurians are extremely skeptical about their technological past. The topic is completely taboo in their society, which can be related to the downfall of their empire. They are reluctant to reveal the locations of their ancient technologies, but I can... But maybe in the future I can acquire some leverage. Ah, these old Lemurians are impenetrable. My spies report that a young Lemurian, Zubiri Kera, has arrived in the city. He is the son of Lemurian priest Yupi Kera. He probably does not know much about their old control, but has a... This is fucking... Common guards... Ooh. I bet you this is Oberon Geller. That was him posing as his father. That's why they were together, right? Oh, I didn't put that together. So, like, you two had to plan to disguise you as him. I don't know why you had, like, a weird servant? Huh. I think. Maybe that's gonna change. Uh, let's go figure out who these guys are. Actually, I don't think we have to. We have to figure out the plot of the events. These are the identities to be discovered. And there's one more major identity we have left. I'm ready to settle my debt to you. I will arrive on Friday at the time you specified. Please be alone. Common Guards, Cuts, and Master Strikes with Longsword by Paul Weber. Will of the Daemon by Isidore Ducks. When Crabs... 2, 1, 3, 4, 1, 2. Guards will attack... Death? Wait, no. Guards will attack after... Lemurian leaves. So the Lemurian has left. Guards will attack after Lemurian leaves. And that was written by... Master of Library. Hmm. That was you. Siva Uduwate. Hmm. It's concealed. You might have a golden idol, natural philosopher, to switch someone's life off, right? What does that imply? No, the that would mean the Seven Seas Company already has it, unless your information is inaccurate. Okay, there's more- no, we have literally every piece of information. We just have to think through it. Okay. Let's figure this out. So the Lemurian has left, so that means I think Zub Or maybe this was supposed to be Zubiri and then he left, right? He like escaped. So Zubiri or maybe he was dressed up as his father to escape, and then this is Me insolence blasphemy. Okay, wait. We know this for certain isn't Albert, right? Because he doesn't know Albain, Al Albion, or what Albion, right? Huh. Okay, well, we know we can figure out there are identities to be discovered. I don't understand how we're missing an identity. That seems a bit important, right? Am I missing something in here? People of whatever. What is this story supposed to represent? Hmm. It's showing the spider is helping out this guy, and he says he's doing magic, right? So the spider is helping with his, like, magic show or something? And then the spider gives him a gift, but... This guy steals his wing. I think this is supposed to be... Educational Pictures for Little Putra by Spider. The music is such a spanger, oh my god, Ah, oh. 
So that appears to be the Royal Navy outside, or Special Guard? Let's figure out who this guy is. I think that's Special Guard, and then... I guess these are ranks, right? Hamadar and... Palace Guard. Right, Orange? Yeah, Orange, and then... Looks like High Rank? No, Mid Rank, so two Mid Ranks, and then... Two Mid Ranks, and then this guy. Oh, God. Oh, no, we missed this. Uh, it's the Anna Printing House. We can go up here, but I don't want to just... Man, it's not breathing. That, um, I wonder why. Tonight during the operation, we'll practice an old Lonkin code. Imagine what the picture represents in the sentence to avoid. Okay. Oh, that was just supposed to be one. It's literally just number of items. Wow. Okay. Guard. Front door. You're supposed to guard the front door. Also, why do you have scooters? Well, that feels weird. Uh. Oh. Okay, you're a low-ranking soldier. Uh, I guess we can probably figure that out, right? You're a Havalidar. Havalidar something. Havalidar. Havalidar. Havalidar, Havalidar, Havalidar. Or is that like rank, right? Havalidar. Yep. Green cap, white apron, no fancy frills on the top. H. H H H H E G H No What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Have a lidar Oh, that means like private Oh, they're all the same Like private something? Okay, well we know your rank You're like low rank Uh, I don't know if that means anything in particular Okay, you had scooters here One of the scooters Hmm. So this is that situation. The water level is supposed to indicate the time, right? So it's now like about the sun is setting, it's midday. So someone came down this. They abandoned their disguise. So once the Lemurian leaves, so maybe someone disguised as the Lemurian, right? He climbed up this and then he left, but they were assuming the identity. One second. I think I know who that is. I think I know who that is. One second, one second. Pink? I don't know if like those like words with the pink. Okay, it's all pink, but uh, you might be... I wonder if you got betrayed. So that might... I think this guy is like... I understand, I think. The spider is supposed to represent Oberon Geller. You are supposed to be... So you did instigate the fight. I was wondering why you like created all these situations where this guy would get into... I understand. You are Zubiri Kara. Where are you? You are Zubiri Kara. I don't know who the fuck this is. <laughs> you are Zubiri Kara. But where Oberon Geller is the spider. It's supposed to show... In the tournament... Geller helped... Zubiri. So, in this case... Zub... You're showing... Oberon manipulated someone into pouring poison. The prince? And then you disguise as someone else? I get it. This is all symbolism. By Spider. Were you, like, bragging? Is that why, like, I knew what you are plotting, like, the first line of the game? Okay, so it's showing... The... God, what was your... Zubiri helping the princess, but the... And then she was supposed to put on the hat, right? But the prince is poisoning it because the Seven Seas Company 
aka the spider, manipulated Oberon Geller, manipulated the prince into pouring poison in the hat into the eye, right? Which I'm guessing when she put this on, she fucking died, right? So these two people, they were upset, right? This was like the people of this place. And then, this is supposed to show that the spider, or I suppose Zubiri is handing a gift to the spider. But then, you leave with the wings. So, the person who escaped isn't Zubiri, it's Oberon Geller. The secret of the golden idol to the spider. The spider created the situation where he saved Zubiri. Because I did think that the whole place was like unnatural. Zubiri Kara. Zubiri Kara. Kara's life. And because the Lumerians have like a thing of life for life, they decided to help her. Therefore, Zubiri Kara. Zubiri Kara. Revealed the secret. Ooh. Life's Zubiri Kara revealed the secret of Golden Idol to the spider. I think that's mostly correct, right? Maybe like... No, his father. His father revealed the secret. You pick Kara. No. Oh, okay. Well, let me think then. Zubiri. Where are you, Zubiri? <laughs> Here. I'll leave that in for now. Save Zubiri Kara's life. Therefore, Zubiri Kara revealed the secret of the Golden Idol to the spider. Right? I'm ready to settle my debt to you. I will arrive at Friday at the time you specified. Please be alone. Youngster. Zubiri Kara has arrived in the city. He probably does not know much about their old culture, but he apparently has amazing paja. They have forced my hands with their conservative stubbornness. I will not allow these old mystics to- Yeah. I get it. Life for life. So he decided to help pay him back, right? And then what was this one again? Guard will attack after he left, so... Okay, one second. You killed- I don't know who the, this guy is. That's like just maybe some random guy? I have to think about that. Probably not, right? Um, you... Meanwhile, Oberon Geller left through the front door and escaped. Or... Yeah, he left through the front door and he stole a thing. I think... Maybe, like, my entire understanding of the situation is wrong. The magic hat is supposed to represent... Like, a sabotage ritual, right? Well, let's say in this case... It's showing, like, a difference between, like, this and this one. I'm guessing that's supposed to be his father? Right? Yupi Kara. Okay, let's say Zubiri Kara. Let's say Yupik Kara. And then this was supposed to be. I don't know what this is supposed to represent. Like, sabotage ritual? Sabotage ritual. Two or fewer are incorrect. Yeah. Oh, I don't understand. Okay. Who's this? This is supposed to represent Oberon... Like, they're supposed to do, like, a ritual... For the... God, I forgot their last name. The, the Ryan. Like, the people of Raya, or like, the people of the Raya. Uh, G something, <laughs> right? And then they failed, but like, they prepared that. This is supposed to show 
because he's grateful, right? He's handing them a present, but he betrays them both. Oh, God. Is this you, Pete Kara? To help the Seven Seas Company, the spider instigated the prince. The prince? The sabotage of the ritual. The rebirth ritual at the Rise Court, but Blank settled it when he. Location of the Golden Idol to that, right? When you pick Kara. Where is it? You pick Kara. <laughs> you pick Kara. I'll just move them from this one. When he revealed the location of the Golden Idol to the Raya, right? Golden Idol. We know that for certain, I think. Okay, I definitely know that for certain. Because the spider had... Or the spider created a situation where he saved Zubiri Kara's life. We know that for certain, right? Therefore, I don't think... Let's, let's undo this, because this might not exactly be true, right? You reveal the situation of the rebirth ritual to the spider. I understand. So you you felt grateful, revealed. So that's how you knew about the ritual, because you're the only person who could know about it. Oh, I see. So he was like drunk, and then he like confided in him, because they had like a drink together. So Zubiri Kara revealed... Where is it? I get it. And then, because the spider had... Uh... Titiana Pre... Okay, one second, that is... <laughs> my brain's blanking a bit. Who is, that? Who is this? He's just like a guy. Which is funny to me, but like, I don't think that's exactly correct. Um... You're not Albert Cloudsley, because he died later. So you're probably... Mm. This has to be Yuki Kara, right? What was the guy's name? Who's the father? It had to be Yuki Kara, I think. I, I want to double check that. <laughs> um, Yuki Kara. Yeah, that's correct. So Yuki Kara is the father. So Yuki... And, then, and this was supposed to be Rebirth Ritual. It's more symbolism. Uh, you peak Kara. You peak Kara. To her fewer slides. Zubiri Kara? R oh, Ritual Ritual. Uh, rebirth Ritual. Okay. Who the fuck is this? Okay, let's figure that out. Um, I don't think it's any of these. Oh, I don't think it's Ruben, right? Master Putrasun. These are five shareholders. Master Putra's son. How do we figure out who this guy is? He just seems to be a random guard? Or, like, is that not the case? Because the spider had... Hmm. Overheard? Let me... I don't want to, like, use this to, like, conceal, like, do my knowledge too much, because... I think that's a bit, but, like, I think I understand, right? Why does the tie matter? Because you wouldn't be able to see them if they were floating through the bloat. Or boat. Right? Because when it's low, you're concealed from the side. So... They couldn't see anyone coming in through the boat through here. I guess. Is that what that's supposed to represent? No, or does it literally just represent the time? Oh my god. Uh, I want to figure out who this guy is, because that seems important. Um, have Iladar, right? So... Oh, you might be like the guy of the library, right? Guard... Front door. Guard front door. And then... 
Who uses that code? It was this guy. Wait, no. Who, who was the who had the code on them? Wait, was it you? No. Tonight during the operation, well, okay, so be follow me. Follow me. Siva Udawate. Huh. Siva Udawate. Like, I want to figure out who that is. Siva Udawate. Like, this could be Siva Udawate, right? Guard front door. No, okay, Siva Udawate is giving out that information, and then... Guards will attack after Lemurian leaves, right? Guards attack... Guards will attack after Lemurian leaves. Also, literally just leaves. You didn't- you could have just left that as- <laughs> Master of Library. So... Meet up- meeting with the nephew of the bookworm. It's the library. Nephew of the bookworm. Pick up the pistol from the repairman. Buy supplies for the boat trip. Meeting with the double widower. Spider? Rehearse the escape plan. No. Meeting with Green Boy. Is Green Boy the guy in like... Meeting with the old butterfly, meeting with the money bag. Rehearse the escape plan. Who the hell is the money bag? Oh my god. Oh. Let me drink some tea. Huh, okay. Think, 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 think. Okay, I think I understand somewhat, but like, so the spider is Oberon Geller. Oberon Geller escaped, right? Because we know that for certain, because the spider created a situation where he saved his life. That has to be Zubiri. It doesn't actually necessarily have to be Zubiri Kara, right? This could be Yupi Kara. Like, this is either Yupi Kara or Zubiri Kara. Oh, maybe that's Zubiri Kara. No, because he's guarding the door. He works for... There's like a third player at play like, that came out of nowhere. Uh... The front door... Oh. We'll hide in the boats and guard the second entrance. So these two are probably the, the second boats, right? Uh, the front door. I will approach the front door with Hamadar Alara Sinha and Kirthi 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 Bandara. So Kirthi Bandara. So one is, has follow me with them, right? So follow me. How do we figure out who this guy is then? Kerfi Bandar. We know, like, this guy is, like, Hamadar, right? So these guys are part of the palace guard, and then those guys are part of the special guard. You told them to follow you. I think. Tonight, we'll, during the operation, we'll practice an old Lonkin code. Got it. About the disaster of the re rebirth ritual. He's the one of the shareholders of, the, uh, shareholders of my duty will not reveal my... He goes by the name of Spider, and I plan to meet him at the printing house on November 22nd. Let me settle my private matters with him first, and then he is all yours. Hmm. Thir 90 sir. So it can only... Oh, that's why it's supposed to say the weight limit. 95 Sarah. And 80 Sarah. One second. So, that might be Reuben. Four vases. A, va a vase is 30 Sarah. So, it'd be 30. Okay, so 120, right? <laughs> My brain is fried. No, it would be 90 Sarah. Wait. 4, 8, 12. Maximum weight limit. Wait, no. 180? 180 Sarah? 
maximum load. 40, 80, 120, 160. My brain is fried. <laughs> My brain. No, it's 30. It's, it's three times four. It's three times four. Oh my god. 12. Okay. That's why we have weights. You can... Mm. Okay, you can go. It definitely can't be you. Right? 100... 200. Oh! And that's why we have heights. I think I get it. That's why we have height profiles. So four and a half... I get it. So it's anyone has to be... They left at a specific time during the boat, right? So they had to be a specific height, so they couldn't get seen, I think. When, when, when was your schedule? Meeting... When's the rehearsal the escape plan? W when's your, like, boat trip? Is it, like, 650? It's so, like, you have a height limit, too. It's just... It's just you! Four half. There's a long and mistress curious about. Three and three fourths half. Okay, I think this is like a half. So you could have left at eight. And that's why you practice the escape plan then, right? So whenever, whenever someone practices the escape plan, they have to be less than. Whoever this, whoever wrote this, the spider, right, has to be... And I'm guessing this is a note from Zubiri? Or... I think. Pick up a pistol. He's the only one who shot a pistol. Rehearse the escape plan. So they practice it at 8, so they have to be 4 or less. And the only person who matches that description would be you. I don't think this guy is here, right? I mean, I guess he could also work, but... You could also work. So, Cloud... I guess I have to keep you guys in mind, too, but, like, it wears expensive clothing. You're wearing expensive clothing. Huh. It can't be you, because you're too fat. <laughs> is this... Are we trying... Are we trying to supposed to, like, figure out who the spider is, right? I don't think you're Albert Geller, right? Because you can't speak. At gunpoint. He held me at gunpoint. What insolence. It's blasphemy. So the person, they have to know... Albi Albion, right? Oh god, like, doing this is like starting to make me go crazy. Um, Oberon Geller escaped through... The door and then killed whatever his name was. The, um, I think that's supposed to show captainship, right? Are you are you saying that like you're this guy or you're this guy? I'll approach the front door with Hamadar Alara Sinha and Havilandar Vanda. How do okay? So we have two names. True guard front door. How do we figure out which one is which in this case, right? What rank are you? I guess circ red circle? Okay, I'll approach the front door. Ambush of the spider. So they wanted to get the spider, right? His plan was to lead through the hatch? Okay, so wait. If you're Zubiri, why would you go through the hatch? I don't think that's correct, right? Is that why... Maybe that is Albert, and that's why he, like, betrayed them, right? Or maybe it's like, uh, you wear expensive clothing for certain. That looks expensive, that could be, like, the weird swords guy, right? Like, we haven't seen any of these, and that just feels wrong that it's like, uh, killed five people. Afraid of heights? No. You couldn't have- you're- okay, well, I think that's supposed to help us determine if you're the spider or not, but like... Late- why- maybe that's why you're here. 
Like, you were afraid of heights, so you couldn't go on the rope escape plan, so you came here. So you decided to leave through here because the boats would have worked for you. So maybe you betrayed this guy. Instigator riots. Somewhat dangerous. He's quiet when it benefits him. I don't... I'm, I don't think it's this guy. I wonder what this guy's deal is, though. Um. Okay, I'm getting confused now. I'm, I'm, I'm like, the more I'm thinking about it, the more confusing it is. Like, we don't know for certain who this is, but it's showing the fact that it's like Yubik, Yubik Kara, and he's left behind, right? I want to figure out the guard's name. And then that's supposed to be someone else. I don't understand who that is. That's supposed to... Sh oh, that's showing the parasol. So that's supposed to be Spymaster, right? So the pa Spymaster and the warrior are crying. Because they've, like, witnessed it. Because the spy... The spider had... Orchestrated... Insta... Investigated? Instigated? Huh. Master Putrasan, I've already shared my suspicions about the disaster rebirth island. The only person who has a death, this has to be. Yeah, okay. This does have to be Zubiri Kara, I think. Right? Uh, because he's the only one who has a debt to him, so he like, tipped off the Spy Master, right? So Zubiri Kara, because the Spy Master had ins instigated uh, blank blank death, right? Or like blank blank the sabotage ritual, right? Um, however, prior to that, Zubiri Kara had tipped off Putra's son about the location of the meeting. Location of the meeting? I don't, I don't know what that one would be. Um, and it'd be Putra's son had, am had planned to ambush Ober uh, Oberon Geller. I guess his name is still not confirmed even after all this. What if it's not Geller? That would be so fucking funny, I'm not gonna lie. After the media tipped the on pre press, right? But had warned within code a message, so he forced blank blank to wear the mask, right? Switch clothes, clothing, and to wear a mask. So he forced Zubiri Kara to switch clothing, to wear a mask, and Zubiri Kara was left as he left through the hatch. I don't know why he why he did that. Uh, he killed someone and escaped. I get it. So after the meeting at, but blank warned had warned him. Uh, who warned him? How did you know? Guards will attack Master of Library. The Master of Library. Why did this guy betray? So like this information isn't trustworthy. Siva Uduwate. Why did you do that? Diva Uduwate... Uduwate had warned... Actually, who is this guy? Why did why did he help him out? I don't understand. Like, they just feel like some random guy jumped in and then saved his life. So, had warned Obron Geller with an encoded message, so, yep. And killed... I don't know who that is. It has to be one of the guards. I just don't know how to identify it. Putra's son... Oh, Hamadir and Havadir. Oh my god, I was only looking at the names. Uh, Havaladir is the lower rank. Havaladir. Havaladir Kithri Bandara. Kithri. So that you are Zubiri Kara, and then you are Kithri Bandara. Kithri. Ki Kithri. 
fuck. Oh no. That's bad. That's real bad. Havaladir Keithri Bandara, right? Havaladir. Yeah, that's 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 correct. So you're not Zubiri Kara. Maybe it's not. No, that has to be Oberon. That has to be Geller. He, he orchestrated it. Maybe it was Ruben. One second. Who set this up? Perhaps a stiff drink will sell. No, you have to be the Spider Oberon. And this is from his from him. Yeah, no, you are 100% the spider. I, I do not doubt that. That is my, like, cornerstone of information I will abide by for, like, the rest of time. I'm so Are you really not... Uh... Where are you? Zubiri Kara? Keithri and there, Oberon Geller. I, are you... You could be Yupik, right? So maybe, like, you try to pay his debt to him. I don't want to just guess that, because, like, I feel like that would be given to me then. Why did he, like, write down his plans on, like, a little thing? Okay, well, we can say you killed Kiri Bandara, right? Fuck. I guess it would be Zubiri Kara, right? Two or fewer slots? Oh, so it has to be Yubik. Because you, you're in a meeting. You're in a meeting with the guy and the spy master, so it has to be you, Peek, because that's who it's representing. I get it. Okay, you, Peek, Kihiri Bandara. And then, this, because the spider had instigated... Uh... Blank ritual... Okay, so, like... I wonder where, where the kid is at this point, right? Or did he leave with... No. Hmm. He's probably in prison. No, he went on the expedition with- Oh my god, of course. He stayed behind with the Raya. It had to be you, Peek. Oh, that was so foolish of me. I can't believe I didn't think about that. Okay. Now, because the spider had instigated... Uh, something failing, right? Okay, one second. <laughs> uh, the location... I need to figure out... Hmm. Zubiri Kara had tipped off... Yupi Kara had tipped off... Putra's son. Or son? <laughs> Where's Putra's son? About the location of the meeting? Is there like a meeting? Ritual door, has clothing... Sabotage... No, it can't be. Arr. He threatened him at gunpoint. So, to like, tell him the location, right? Because the spider had... Oh, I'm trying to figure out what this could be. Like, it's a gift to the spider. Why is it, like, it's supposed to re be repaying him for the life of... Uh, for saving his life, right? Life for a life, that's his principle? In fact, I think that's what Yupik was saying to the Raya. Because the spider had instigated... no... Because the spider had saved, like, there we go, uh, Zubiri Kara's life. Yupi Kara revealed the location, location, uh, location, location, location of the golden idol. Where is it? Where is it? Golden Idol to him at Titiana Press. However, prior to that, Yupi Kara tipped them off about Putra's son, about the location of the... 
Uh, I don't, I don't know what yellow word would fit here. Ritual, like sabotage, betrayal, meeting. Huh. Look the time, the location. It's not a ritual. The location of the clothing, <laughs> rebirth, ritual, sabotage. I guess it is sabotage because he technically like traded location oh however prior to that Yuppie Kara tipped Putra's son about the location of the spider I understand the Lemurian priest had hoped to fulfill his honor bound duty by revealing the location of golden idol to Oberon Geller before allowing Putra's son to ambush and arrest them but Oberon had been forewarned, so he forced Yupik to exchange clothing at gunpoint and made him wear a mask. While Putra's people were distracted by the mask Yupik, Oberon, disguised as the priest, killed the guard and escaped with the map. What a fucking cool puzzle. Oh my god. Oh, that is sick. I love that. Listen, Albert. And this is the start of the first events. I hold a proposition of business. Thank you for playing the Spider of Lanka. Well, the spider was... <laughs> and I guess that's him in the, like, shadows. Oh no, that's supposed to be the Raya. Why is it, like, shadow here? Well, <laughs> that is so cool. I love that. Ah. Oh. Okay, I think I understand everything about that, right? So, like, every event was orchestrated, but I wonder, like, I was wondering why, like, he made a matchup against this guy, right? Like, there was no reason for him to do that? Huh. So, it was an attempt to get him to save his life. So, he sacrificed two friends to do it, too, which is fucked, right? Ruben, you were just pretending to be asleep because you're part of the Seven Seas Company, which we knew were actually ready. And then during this time... You weren't disguised as him, of course. That's like the actual Yupik, right? So Yupik, he negotiated a deal where he would reveal the location of Golden Idol, right? Or... I don't know what you actually revealed to him. I assume you revealed to him the location of Golden Idol, but like, that might not be true. Right, so you, he must join me on this journey as insurance for your honesty. So he revealed something, right? No, it was the Golden Idol, right? No, he just revealed a secret. I think I, I was just making my assumptions. So, you did life for life because you had to give away the Fountain Louvre because it was your honor bound duty as a Lemurian. And then, you had a secret, so there's no way it could have been Zubiri, so must have joined me on the journey, so he already left. And I got confused. Okay. Huh, <sighs> that's such a cool puzzle. Anyhow. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, have a nice night. <laughs> I'll be playing the Lemurian Vampire next. How could I not? That's such a cool puzzle. Anyway, bye.